Hey y'all, this is Chris and Josh, Team A Action today at a 1962 Flip in Memorial. Uh, flips are always a fun time for home inspectors. We find all kinds of good stuff and, uh, and no doubt gonna find some good stuff today. Let's go check it out. Whoa, man. Whoa. That's, that's my line. Oh, I got it, Let's sorry. Let's check it out. I got excited. <laughs> All right, so we're up on the roof. Uh, roof seems to be about half-life. It's got a good amount of granules left uh, for a flip job. Overall, not in bad shape. All the flashing looks good. It's painted, it's sealed. Uh, no water stains on the decking in the attic. Getting off the roof, the next thing I notice on the outside is they replaced most of all the siding with hardy. We have a few spots on the exterior on the sides of the home where we have wood and the wood's pulling loose a little bit, but on a flip, of this age, you're gonna get that kind of damage on the most part. The biggest positive sign is like, hey, we have a bunch of new siding out here and it looks like it's been properly done. All right, let's move on to the next phase of this inspection. All right, as we come around to the side, to the brick exterior, we notice some signs of cracking and more repair. Generally on a home this age, this isn't a huge cause for concern because it's natural sediment over the years. Uh, we also see that they have rerouted the cast iron drain lines and put in the PVC. So now that we've observed this, this is something that we want the uh, buyers to check the seller's disclosure as to how they rerouted the plumbing. One of the next things that we noticed on this property is that they replaced all the windows, which that is awesome because we're starting to get the feeling that the person that flipped this home really spent the money where it matters. They just didn't make it look good like, it, like in my previous video where they didn't have, all they did was make the bathrooms and kitchens look good. So all new windows is definitely a plus on a flip. That's something you want to look for. All right, let's head up in the attic. That's where we find most of our issues on flips and where they kind of cut corners. So now we're up in the attic space and I'm going to talk about all the good stuff that we see first. Um, first off, you have brand new ductwork, which is pretty awesome. Usually in flips you see a newer AC unit but old duct system, so this is great. We also have new blown-in insulation and they even spent the money to put the spray-on radiant barrier, which uh, improves the energy efficiency of the home. Um, they've also added some new purlin supports and uh, new wood to the structure, so we really know, we know that they're really thinking about not just the cosmetic uh, issues of this old home. Now, as a home inspector, we always find stuff, so there are a few things uh, that we want to point out to attic space. First, further back, you can't really see from this vantage point, but further back there are some split rafters, which are pretty typical in an old home, but we want to recommend that they sister new wood up to the split rafters so it's properly supported. And then over here, the, uh, the water heater is actually leaning to the side, so we want to straighten that out so it doesn't cause any future damage to the attic space and the inside of the home. All right, moving on to the inside of the bathroom, they redid the entire bathroom and you've known before where I've talked about where they only done the cosmetics, where they just made it look nice. Well, today that is not the case. They redid the galvanized water lines and now they are copper, which is fantastic. And then also we're assuming, we, we do see there's PVC underneath the ground here behind the tub and outside. So they may have redone all the drain lines. We want to either contact the seller and see if it was all done or run a sewer scope scan to double check and make sure it was done correctly underneath this underneath the slab. Home inspectors cannot complete this. Uh, the board track stops us from doing that. You should uh, vote and talk to them about that. But anyways, back to it. This flip is actually turning out and it's starting to look pretty good. Uh, let's go outside and talk about it and close out this video. All right, closing out this video, not all flips are bad. You know, this one actually is done pretty well. We have a new AC, newer AC unit. It's not uh, brand new, but it's newer to the property. We also have a good, okay looking roof. It's about half life. We have uh, new water lines, a newer electrical panel box. So, um, I mean, what do you think? I think it was done pretty well. Oh yeah, yeah. anytime you're talking about a flip that goes beyond cosmetics and deals with structural and even energy efficiency with the new windows and the new insulation, you know you're getting a, a good flip job right there. Yeah, definitely. All right, guys, uh, if you like these videos, please like, subscribe, and hit that bell. And if you hit that bell, you'll get the notification the next time one of my videos come on. All right, guys, take it easy. Let's go. Uh, I mean, see ya. <laughs> <laughs> Hey guys, this is Chris with A Action today. I got another 1962 flip. These are gonna be awful. I always say that these are terrible. It's gonna be just a pile of junk. 
So uh, we're gonna find a whole lot of stuff today. It should be a good video. Let's go check it out. What are you doing, man? Oh, hey, what's up, man? <laughs> uh, I was, I saw your camera. I was kind of messing around. Oh, oh yeah, okay. So, uh, 